I love this movie so much. I will never let anyone ruin it for me. Bye, Bella. Good luck at your new school. Have a good <laughs> life. You got to be able to reach me and Phil on the road. I love saying that on the road. Now, you know, if you change your mind, I'll race back here from wherever the game is. I won't change my mind, Mom. You might. You've always hated forks. It's not about forks. It's about Dad. Mom, I want to go. I'll be fine. Bella, where you been, loca? No way. The truck is for me? Oh, it's perfect. <laughs> Block it, Chloe. Yeah, good attack. She's got a great spike, doesn't she? So, you're from Arizona, right? Aren't people supposed to be tan down there? <gasps> Who are they? The Cullens. Dr. and Mrs. Cullens' foster kids. They all moved down here from Alaska two years ago. They kind of keep to themselves. Because they're all together. Like, together, together. The blonde girl, Rosalie, and the big dark haired guy, Emmett. They're a thing, and I'm not even sure that's legal. But they live together. And the little dark-haired girl, Alice, she's really weird. Oh, who's he? That's Edward Cullen. He's totally gorgeous, obviously. But apparently no one here is good enough for him. Like I care. Anyway, don't waste your time. Oh, I wasn't planning on it. But she was, because he is vengeance. Na 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 na, pet man. No, every class is full. I'm afraid you'll have to stay in biology. I'm so sorry. Let the girl eat her cod, Waylon. <sighs> when you're done, I'll bring you your favorite berry cobbler, remember? Your dad still has it every Thursday. I can cook. I do the cooking at home in Phoenix. Mom's not great in the kitchen. <laughs> Now, tell me more about your school, baby. What are the kids like? Are there any cute guys? Are they being nice to you? They've all been really welcoming. But not really, Mom. Why are they even in the bathroom? They don't pee. Freaks. Dad, I can drive myself to school. Ugh. Ice doesn't help the uncoordinated. You got me new tires. No one's ever done that before. I mean, nothing. Pro face. Like I said, duh. Uh, seriously, you're asking me about the weather? My mother stayed home with me, but it made her unhappy because, like, she hates me. So I decided to spend my time with my father instead who doesn't hate me. Did you get contacts? Your eyes were black before, but now they're golden brown or something. You were next to your car across the lot. Yes, you were. Don't fucking gaslight me, asshole. I know what I saw. That was the first night I dreamed of Edward Cullen. Oh, prom, as in dance. I, uh, have to go somewhere. To Jacksonville. <laughs> yeah. No oh, non-refundable ticket. But maybe you should ask Jessica. Guess who just asked me to the prom? I totally thought Mike was going to ask you, Bella. But it's, is it going to be weird? No way. Zero weirdness. <laughs> you guys are great together. I know, right? Too bad you didn't figure that out earlier. You could have let the van crush me and saved yourself all this regret. I know you do, you manipulative asshole. The bus is leaving. Oh, hi. Will you be riding with us? Glubbush, baby. <laughs> Thanks, but your mood swings are giving me whiplash. What does that even mean? Okay, how about radioactive spiders? Kryptonite? I thought you were a Pat-Man. I keep thinking Eric's going to ask me to the prom, but then he just doesn't. You could ask him. Take control. You're a strong, independent woman. Oh, I am. She invited Edward. To be polite. No, I think it's nice she invited him. No one ever does. 
they're like, you want to go look at the tide pools? I think this halter makes my boobs look big. What do you think, Bella? She was right about this halter, though. <laughs> it does look great on my tits. <laughs> Were you following me? So that's a yes, you stalker? <laughs> All right. So you read minds. What am I thinking? Wait. Okay, now. Go. You're impossibly fast and strong. Your skin is pale white, ice cold. Your eyes change color, and sometimes you speak like you're from another time. You never eat food or drink or come out in the sunlight. And you said no to the beach trip only after you heard where it was because of the treaty. How old are you? How long have you been 17? I know what the cold ones are, what you are. Vampire. Wow. You're beautiful. It doesn't matter <laughs> for some reason because you're that beautiful, I guess. I trust you, question mark, Edward, but I like bad boys. Oh, I thought you hated me when we met. I get it now. Okay. I know you can until you can't. And then I'll be like, oh my God, now I get all the red flags. Wow. Oh, not of that. <laughs> I'm afraid that like you'll disappear and that I'll lose you forever. And I can't because I'm so in love with you. <laughs> I'll die. Stupid lamb. About three things I was absolutely positive. One, Edward was a vampire. Two, there was a part of him that thirsted for my blood. And three, I was falling unconditionally and irrevocably in love with him. He's my whole life now. I know I'm only 17, but like, I'm in love forever. Your house with your family? But what if they don't like me? Uh, bon giorno? Molto bene. No, she should know. The entire family will be implicated if this ends badly. Badly? Oh, badly, like where I become the meal. <laughs> right. Hi, Bella. I'm Alice. Oh, you do smell good. You don't scare me. God. Uh. They took the bait. I love when men chase me. <laughs> Actually, Forks is kind of growing on me. Could... A guy have something to do with that? Maybe. Tell me everything. Jock, Indy, bet he's smart. Is he smart? Well, he's kind of a history buff. I, uh, have to go. No way. We gotta talk, boys. Are you being safe? Uh, I'll call you later, Mom. You've been here before, you stalker? You're a peeping Tom, <laughs> perv. <laughs> Stop. I didn't see them. Like that'll help. I could smell her from across the field. The humans were tracking us, but we led them east. What? Charlie's there. He's in danger because of me, because of us. I said, leave me alone. I have to get out of this place, out of Forks. I'm leaving now. Get out. It's over. Like watch more baseball on the flat screen or go to the coffee shop. Same people, same steak, same berry cobbler every night. That's you, Dad. It's not me. And if I don't get out now, I'm gonna get stuck here like mom did. Edward, are you all right? Bella? Bella, where are you? 
Calm down, Mom. Everything is fine, okay? I'll explain every... I can't bring myself to regret the decisions that brought me face to face with death. They also brought me to Edward. No, Edward, don't! <laughs> it's on fire, my hand. It's like burning. Death is peaceful, easy. Life is harder. You're awake, baby. You're okay. Baby, you fell down two flights of stairs and through a window. Sounds like me. Charlie doesn't like him. Blames him for you leaving. What do you think? I think that boy is in love with you. I am alive because of you. What? No! I want to be with you! I don't want it! <laughs> Edward, why did you save me? If you'd let the venom spread, I could have been like you by now. And I've decided! No one will surrender tonight. I won't give in. I know what I want! <laughs> Turns out she is vengeance.